Sports Interactive's football manager, games have never been as glamorously successful like the likes of FIFA or Pro Evolution Soccer, but their sizable fan base will tell you that they offer the best football experience you'll ever find. With a keen focus on management, tactics, and strategy, the football manager games offer endless content that you can lose yourself in for literally hundreds of hours, while the series remains one of a few annual sports franchises that steadily sees improvements with each new installment. Football Manager 2022 is coming up soon, and Developer Sports Interactive is promising similar improvements. Here, as we count down the days to the game's launch, we'll be taking a look at some key details that you should know about. Data Hub Pouring over statistics, spreadsheets, heat maps, and what have you, and adjusting your team and tactics accordingly is a crucial part of the football manager experience, and to that end, this series consistently makes improvements in this area each year. Football Manager 2022 is going to be no different in that regard, with a new and improved data hub that you'll be able to dive into before each map. Past maps, match flow, and various other tactical analysis will be available here for you to study and leverage as you decide your tactics for a game. Deadline Day Deadline Day is an important part of any football management experience, which of course includes the FM games as well. And the final day of every transfer window will see tweaks in Football Manager 2022 as well. For starters, it'll come with a change in UI, with your hub screen transforming to show elements such as player offers, agent negotiations, transfer news, expiring contracts, and a deadline day countdown and more. Meanwhile, the rumor mill is also going to be made an important part of deadline day to make it a more authentic experience, with stories of where players might be headed cropping up, while players will also be able to talk to the press with specific options relating to potential transfer activity. Animations the actual on-pitch action has always taken a bit of a back seat in Football Manager games, appropriately enough, but the series does make some important improvements to its match engine with each new installment, which it will be doing with Football Manager 2022 as well. For starters, there is a new and improved animation system in the game, which means players and the ball should move during a match more naturally than in past games. Meanwhile, other improvements will also improve the match day experience, which brings us to our next point. Other improvements. While the new animation system is the highlight of improved match engine in Football Manager 2022, it does bring some other important improvements as well. For starters, the AI has been improved, which means players will make much better decisions both on and off the ball. This is an area where the series has been frustratingly inconsistent over the years, so hopefully the improvements being applied in FM 2022 will make a noticeable difference. Meanwhile, stamina is also going to be more emphasized now, which means players will tire out more quickly based not just on their fitness and sharpness, but also on your tactics and how the match is going, forcing you to switch things around during the game. Management Improvements other improvements are being made to the off-pitch management simulation parts of the game as well, which of course is the meat and potatoes of the experience. For instance, different clubs will have different budgets, which will give rise to different challenges and objectives, such as having to reduce the size of your squad and free up some of your wage bill and generate more budget for yourself. Scouting is also being improved, with all the details and communications regarding the players you're scouting now being presented in a clearer and more convenient manner. Wide center backs. For all the budding managers out there who like to play with more attacking defenders and play out from the back, there's good news for you. Football Manager 2022 is introducing a new role for your defenders, namely wide center back. Specifically for those who like to play with three players at the back, the wide center back should prove to be a useful option. Of course, you'll have the freedom to decide how attacking or not these players will be. Football Manager as a series has always excelled at giving players an abundance of tactical options during games to tweak your strategies as you see fit, and it's great to see that Sports Interactive is adding more options with this year's game. Touch Version Football Manager's yearly releases usually go hand-in-hand -hand with a new Football Manager Touch version as well, which 
as its name implies, is a modified version of the game made primarily for mobile devices. This year will be a little different, though. Due to production complications brought up by COVID, Sports Interactive and Sega have had to cancel the iOS, Android, and PC versions of Football Manager Touch 2022, which means that this version of the game will be available exclusively on the Nintendo Switch. Of course, PC players can and will play the full fetch base experience of FM 2022, but those on mobile devices are sadly going to be left out. Launch. Football Manager 2022 is not too far away now. It'll follow in its footsteps of its predecessors and launch in November, and will be available on PC, Xbox Series X and S, Xbox One, and Nintendo Switch. Like last year's game, Sports Interactive has publicly talked about why FM 2022 is going to be available on Xbox consoles, but not on PlayStation. Apparently, they approached Sony to bring Football Manager to PlayStation consoles, but Sony doesn't seem to be interested in that, which, in turn, means Sports Interactive simply doesn't have access to the development kits it needs to release the game for the PlayStation 4 or 5. Game Pass Regardless of if you're playing Football Manager 2022 on PC or an Xbox console, you'll be able to access the game through the Game Pass. That's right, the Management Simulations title, PC and Xbox versions, will be available on Xbox Game Pass for PC and consoles respectively right on the day of launch. Meanwhile, both Game Pass versions will also feature cross saves, which means you can take your progress across platforms as well. And with that, we've reached the end of this video. Have anything to say? Let us know in the comments below. Also, we upload new videos every day on Gaming Bolt, so please consider subscribing as it really helps us out. Thanks for watching.